Okay, guys, so I wasn't originally going to record, but look what I just got on Deadlocked. So, I just practiced a bit today. Literally the day after I beat Theory of Everything Theory, theory of Everything 2. I want to go through practice mode so you guys can see the whole level. First part, cube part, mixed with a little way. Again, just like every other beginning part of the level, generally pretty easy. Maybe Club Step is an exception because Club Step's cube part is kind of tricky when you don't know what's coming up. Okay. This wave part is easy only once you figure out uh, how to control transitions from the normal wave to the upside down wave. Okay, why am I dying here? As soon as I stop talking, it works. And then you just go up and down, up and down. It's just up, down, up, down. I grabbed the key on accident. I, I never really do that on purpose, but sometimes I get it. One, two, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three. UFO jumps, baby. Little jump, medium jump, medium jump. Bing, 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 memorization. I played this part so much, I I don't think I've really ever died here. This part, I die to if I'm too nervous, so I really gotta focus on hitting those orbs. This part, probably one of the easiest parts of the entire level, other than the very end. This is where it gets really nerve-wracking. This is where I'm probably gonna die a lot. Just go up and down, up and down. Just be patient with this. You go one, two, three, and then this part, which actually I don't have that much trouble with. Surprisingly, a lot of people have a trouble with the double wave, but I actually don't. This is where I have a trouble with. I, my high score is literally this first cube inside this thing. Not that one, but first one. And then you go up, and then you straight, and you go down, up, big down, back up. If I can get past the ship with all the moving cubes, I have a good chance. And it's just easy from then on. I feel like I can do it just like the beginning of Theory of Everything 2. It's like I know where they're going to go, but I, I just get so nervous and I kind of forget in the moment. You know, like when you're in class and uh, you studied, but as soon as someone calls on you or the teacher calls on you, you just go blank in the brain. Oh, I, I got too I got too excited and I, I clicked too fast. I don't know why this level doesn't make me as mad as Theory of Everything 2 and Club Step. But, like, there's not as much invisible blocks and like, oh, where are you supposed to go? I don't like that kind of gameplay. I like straightforward, but somewhat difficult, you know? I almost got the key there. What? I pressed it. But the best part is that once I beat this level, I don't have to worry about any of the Rob Top levels ever again. I don't have to play this game ever again. Although I'll probably still play it. For like the custom levels, you know? Oh, the robot jumps on that part are so specific. Like you gotta, you can't hold it too long. Sometimes you gotta tap like it's the cube and it just, it confuses me. Even though I don't really die on that part that much, but I have been more recently for some reason. Again, 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 that part, dude, that part. This feels nice. One percent! New high score! Let's go! I just gotta get past the rocket part. I actually died at that part? No! <laughs> again! Again, dude! Again! Ha <laughs> I pressed it twice instead of once, are you fu- It's the same few parts that prevent me from beating it. You know, excluding the the occasional stupid death in the very beginning, but we don't talk about those. We don't talk about those. I held it, dude. I didn't hold it early enough, man. How? How did I die there? I've never died there before, dude. I'm in the sad stage. First stage, optimistic. Second stage, anger. Third stage, sadness. I'm in the sadness stage again, because I know I can beat it. But I just can't for some reason. That rocket part is keeping me from beating the level. Dude, why? What am I doing? I'm getting there fairly consistently, but I just can't. I can't. I can't beat it. Again. I, again. Again. Again! I hate it when that happens, man. It's only happened a few times, but every time it happens, it infuriates me because it shouldn't happen. Obviously, none of these deaths should happen, but they do. I thought I pressed it, dude. I'm about to fuck. And I thought I was getting good at the ship, but that's the part that I'm dying at the most, the ship parts. 
I thought beating clubs up in TOE2 would help me, but I guess not. And I died because I pressed one too many times. I don't know what is, I need to take a break, man. I need to take a break. I, I've been, only been recording for like 35 minutes, but it feels like it's been two hours. I'm getting 1% every f***ing time! I was tied there, but the Let's go! Let's go! Thank you guys so much for watching. 1100 attempts. <laughs> uh, plus 186, so like 1300 attempts. I don't care that my webcam was off. Dude. I was so close to dying in that shit part, I told you, that's the hardest part of the level for me. And maybe for some other people. Holy shit. Thank you all so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you're not already. I am now the Demon Hunter. Watch out, user levels, I'm coming for you. Maybe not, I'm taking a, I'm taking a fucking break from this game. The amount of stress I've had. I'll see you guys in a bit. Peace.